The Uganda Virus Research Institute has used genomic sequencing to identify new viral infections identified from ticks and mosquitoes. And uh, we don't know yet whether they are going to get into the human population or if when they get into the human population they are going to cause serious diseases or not. According to the Deputy Director of the Uganda Virus Research Institute, Dr. Julius Lotuama, Uganda is considered a hotspot for emerging diseases. He says it is estimated that internationally more than one million viruses of epidemic potential have not been identified. Every time Ugandans, we should be prepared. Like I said, we are a hotspot. We are in an area where new infections are going to emerge. All those which emerged earlier are going to come back uh, which will refer to as re-emerge and probably cause problems in the country. As a result, the World Health Organization is emphasizing the importance of this technology to understand the characteristics of disease variants, their mutations, how to deal with specific variants, among others. It also uh, gives you the characteristics of the, the TB or uh, HIV and associating it, what are the changes we are seeing in genetically as well as character wise does it create resistance does it create higher transmissibility so understanding that would enable us to to respond better but also in terms of developing of vaccines for example in terms of genomic sequencing in this country we have built good capacity like at our uganda virus research institute our central public health laboratory, and even the labs at Makerere. Close to 140 disease outbreaks are detected annually across Africa, and it is critical for member states to develop border strategies that speak to each other, since disease outbreaks do not respect country borders. What we are calling a continental uh, framework, which is really a guidance document to those that may be interested in developing their strategies. Um, so, like I said, that each of these uh, strategies has to read from the other uh, to ensure that uh, we uh, make our continent safe and uh, we are able to respond to any emergencies. Relatedly, studies conducted by the Central Public Health Laboratories indicate increasing resistance to the HIV drug, DTG, among some people living with HIV. But as government, we are putting in efforts to make sure that the systems that allow patients to adhere to treatment get good access to treatment, quick access to treatment are there. No, but at Kunda, in TV News.